go. Harry McClary's rumpus at the vet. Harry McClary's rumpus at the vet. Down at the vet, there are all kinds of pets with troubles and more with their ears to their toes, itches and stitches and tummy ache too. So many animals watch from them wailing and Harry McClary and Donald and Jerry. There were miserable dolls, cantankerous cats, a rabbit with pimples and rickety rats, mice with the sneezes, a goat in a rage, and Cassie the cockatoo looked in her cage. Cassie had claws and a troublesome beak. She saw something twitch, so she gave it a tweak. She pulled it so hard that she plucked out her hair. And Harry McClary jumped high in the air. A bowl full of mice was bundled about. Over it went and the mice tumbled out. Four fussy budgies with Grandma's dog flew out of their cage with the bottom dropped off. Grizzly McDuff with a bottle brush tail leaked out of his basket and over the rail. The Papa Dumb Kittens from Parkett's in place squeezed through an opening and joined in the chase. Barnacle Beasley forgot it's he was sore. No, Jordan, that's not... <sighs> Can you say it again? Keep going. Okay. Yeah. Barnacle Beasley forgot he was sore. He bumbled and glattered all over the floor. Then Custard the Labrador, Muffin McClee and Moodle McPoodle decided to play. They skibbered and scabbered, they slid all around and bottles and boxes came tumbling down. What a kerfuffle, a scramble of paws, a tangle of body, a jumble of chores, with squawking and yowling and mournful meow. They really were making a terrible row. Out came the vet, I'll fix them, she said, but she tripped on a lead and fell over instead. These are the goat crushed, these the goat crushed into a cage. He butted the bars in a thundering rage. Cassie got mad. She rattled her beak. She saw something twitch, so she gave it a tweak. I mean, please, no. Can I see it? Can I? 